Yeah, we're going to stack up on some armors. Why this here? I don't have armor. And I haven't played the past few days, so I'm just warming up and getting back into the flow. So I figured I could rock the shitty gun. And I don't have a backpack. So I have I have a pilgrim. I didn't have a different color backpack. So I did nighttime because pilgrim doesn't matter as much at night. During the daytime on a green map, you stick out like a sore thumb with a pilgrim. But nighttime, it's fine. And so Although, again, with the queue taking so long, and there's a, it's overcast, so it's even darker. Probably should have brought a flashlight or night vision goggles. Not gonna be able to see my opponents at all, really. You can put a flashlight on the RFB? Um, no, actually you can't. <laughs> but I could have rocked a different weapon that I could have put a flashlight on. Or a helmet with a flashlight. What's with the hit on the RFB? I don't think I don't mean to hate on it. It is probably the worst of the 76251 weapons. Or second worst. This or the hunter. But for a budget weapon, it's okay. But since I can't buy guns on this account, I'm stuck with what I have and I have uh better weapons than this. That's why I say it's the worst weapon on this account. Why is the RFB worse than the SR25 or our sauce? Ergo and um, recoil. The two stats that actually matter. Like with the uh, SR25 and the RSAS, you can put flashlights on it. Or lasers or infrared devices, stuff like that. Attack devices. And they just perform better. And then this gun does deliver good ammo. 76251. Not bad. Looking for actual reasons. Yeah, no, it's, it's just the... Ergo and recoil, which when you're not suppressed, the ergo is fine. Now that's a decent aim down sight speed. for being a naked player. I don't know where that scab ahead guy was. Could have been up top. I think it was. Fuck, I forgot meds. Needs meds. I mean, the sausage doesn't look delicious. That's a good looking sausage right there, dude. Back in this. Oh my goodness. Another pilgrim. 
Only you could stack them. Nice. What AK? This is the AK-104. there's any weapon attachments I actually need or weapon attachments we need but um toolboxes tools order items add out upgrades etc I'm looking for armors more than anything not that type of armor <clears throat> yeah Zular dude you would you would go out a raid with like 30 backpacks well at least on labs you have black um black rock but uh beta st beta bags stack inside beta bags stack inside beta bags it's insane oh i do need xenomorphs so i do need to be hitting the toolboxes I need xenomorphs and hand drills and three blue tapes you started collecting the items for kappa not yet soon Someone just sniped that guy on the roof. Don't know where he would have got sniped from, though. Damn. Got ears now, though. I mean to discard that. He's on the turret. I think so. I'd imagine he's going to come up here. And now he's going to be watching up here. That sucks. Kind of give me a tell on where he might be, though. <sighs> if he's already expecting someone to be up here.
No, those in NVGs don't mount my gun, unfortunately. Or my helmet, rather. I got my armor, so that's what I came for. Do we want the MK over the... Kind of. Convenient, convenient. Sharp back plates? No, I, I need them. No, I need them, need them, but that the whole point in this run was the armors. I need to go to Path to Shoreline. I don't think I have. I do have Northern. Oh. Well then. <laughs> the pilgrim uh, no it's not super safe down there yeah if someone did try to pick that pilgrim up I would have uh I would have killed him yeah, they're pretty chunky right now. Honestly, not bad though. We got the uh, MK16 with the suppressor, AK104 with the suppressor, M4 with the suppressor. Got three different armors. New helmet, another new helmet. Ears, ears. I could have taken that my other gun back. I could have taken the suppressor off this and went and got the RFB. But to be honest with you, I have I have so many guns that use 76251. I didn't want to. Uh, I didn't want to use up a slot. Or not use up a slot, but you use uh, more of that 76251. I've got the train leaving in one minute, but I am worried that there's already someone on it. Did you find the bloody rusty key? You, you can't get it in the mall anymore. You have to get it off um, player scavs or AI scavs. They can, they can spawn in their backpacks. Have the shuttle run a little bit to the extract drop it run a little bit to the extract drop it Hmm. 
I ditched the RFB. I have too much seven, too many seven six two five one weapons to need it. it. It served its purpose. I just wanted to get some armor and weapon upgrades this round. <clears throat> we successfully did that. It was nice of that guy that, to bring me a backpack because uh, I was able to shuttle this stuff a little easier. Basically, you try to separate the weight between the two bags. That's why I moved everything out of a lot of my heavy items out of my rig back into the bag. I moved the weapon off my character into the bag. The weapon's going to count as weight either way when it's on me. Now, when I drop that and go pick the other one up, it just, I'm lighter. I'm not gonna be able to bring this bag out unfortunately I wouldn't have enough room to separate all the shit I need we got 75.5 kilograms that's the round we were looking for I want to rock my shitty weapons and, and we have plenty of decent weapons. We don't really need to rock one of the shitty ones. I guess this would be one of my shitty ones. That ammo pickup was pretty clutch too. The guy had a hundred rounds of M um, M8.56A1. We'll go for one more or armor run. Okay, this round we're getting the Xenomorph, hand maybe not the hand drill. We're going to try for the hand drill and three blue tape. Three blue tape and Xenomorph. The rogues are more aggressive towards the bears. Um, USEC, the rogues can be a little more chill with if you haven't killed them in a few rounds. I'm gonna cut left here so we kind of avoid the bridge. This is like black and white. Am I colorblind? Also didn't hear any rogues up top yell at me. I don't know if I saw any on the far turret either. Had good ammo on it. Doesn't look like very many rounds. No, but it's some nonetheless. And we might find more. Some sometimes rogues don't spawn. Correct. Yeah, it's very rare, but it is possible. Is it safer with nighttime? Depends on what you consider safer. Um, yes, in the sense that you're not having to deal with um, as many player scaps. And the rogues are not nearly as aggressive. But no, in the sense that... Uh, that the PMCs you run into, they're, they're way chattier. I do the amount of PMCs that I've ran into that have been rocking like, that's where I've gotten all my fleers and, you know, good night vision goggles. Xenomorph? Nice. But it wouldn't hurt. It's 
Because I'm going to already be heavy from this run. Since I'm grabbing armor, so there's a fucking tank battery. I don't need it, though. I don't think... I don't think I need tank batteries for anything. But that's where it is. I remember that round, actually. It was also Lighthouse. I can't take him from here, but I... I don't think he spots me with uh nighttime. That's the best thing about nighttime raids though on the real is uh I overpeaked that. Burst fire scabs are terrifying, dude. It's like the second they lock on, it, being naked especially, they they're gonna tap on the plus side, didn't have anything we really needed. Uh, Xeno, the Xenomorph, but I'm not that worried about it. And it's about the only time I'm going to be rocking the Pilgrim bags to be uh, a lighthouse run. I don't know if I can put a flashlight on it. Okay, I can. We did not have a good spawn for this. The first few days, I'd play two to three hours on the main, and then I'd hop on, and then, then I lowered it down to like an hour to two, and I'd hop on, and I just started playing on the count. Once we got enough gear that it didn't matter. Holy fuck, dude. It scared the shit out of me. So what do you have? I'm not even, not even night vision. Funny enough, I was going to the low side because I figured that was going to be the safer route. <laughs> All right. We got one more pilgrim backpack here to give it a go. There we go. All right. We didn't have a good spawn for it last round. This should be a better one here, hopefully. We're going in and uh, going to secure an armor three, hopefully. Then we're going to be going through the rest of the quest line. Ah, uh, we got... Hopefully this northwest spawn on the beach. Or south spawn again. Damn. The shittiest spawn for trying to secure some armors. <laughs> that door's open. It's not supposed to be. That scab laugh at me inside. It's probably just AI. Disengage out. I need to take that fight. Yeah, the rogues are coming. Oh, loud they coming. this door see what happens right in the face give me your shit is it psm or is it fmj fmj damn Nice to meet you, brother. This is my home. Entry, please.
Okay, so hindsight, I probably should have just moved that gold chain over. We're a little heavy. A smidge. A teensy bit of weight on us right now. We're packing. Yeah, we need xenomorphs. And blue tape. shot up because that's pathetic Oh, there's another one right there. Get away from the shuffle. Give me the shuffle, bro. Is he not going to? We have casualty. What another one there? Wow, all three on that corner. And I think one up top here. Let's get a belt rig on. I would like that. I can't see up there for shit. Oh, the gazelle too. Naturally, naturally. Okay, we are out of space for the larger items. I don't know what the Big Easy book, Cookbook can trade for. I'm going to drop this label. Oh, wait. Just kidding. We're not out of space. I need the hand drill, man. Whoever's running up top is going to steal my shit. 
Let's slow creep and then hope I don't get got. So all three of the rogues are over in this corner. Very sneaky sneak. The sneakiest of sneaks. Sneaks so sneaky that he could never sneak it coming. This armor for a quest. Okay. I'm not gonna take it. Even though I want to. Not going to. A creepy laugh. I take this because I can use the MPV in the hideout for extra storage. I have. I can't. I can't just leave behind that loot though. It's not, otherwise I would see the butt of it, the cart, the tail lights, right? I think so. No. Okay, we need to get to the train then. Under northern? I don't have northern. Oh, I do. Where did I spawn? Oh, I spawned on the far south road, didn't I? I thought I spawned next to the village house. Okay, well that's much, much more simple. Do you plan on doing Shooter Born in Heaven? Uh, here soon-ish. Hello. Hello, comrade. I don't know what that trades for, if anything. Same with the book. Oh, well, actually I have a little bit of room that I can keep stuff Oops. that train's gonna leave very soon yep okay so we're not making it to the train that's fine Drop Crone and wear Gazelle. The Crone repairs much better than the Gazelle. The Gazelle is going to be a little bit better of an armor, but the, the Crone just you get more uses out of it. And that is why I'm taking it. Want to keep so many Afax? Uh, use them. It's a hardcore count, so it, it, this I'm more worried about. And honestly, Afax sell well. I'm more worried about stuff that I will use than stuff that will sell better. Oh, 
Oh my goodness, dude. I want to have this other mag in it because it has PS ammo and I might kill scavs, but I'm not pro likely not going to run into a player, hopefully, at this point. So PS ammo would be better to take down the AI. I'll waste some better ammo. Damn. At least we got one Xenomorph. I probably should have grabbed the hand drill. Hand drills are easy to come by, though. Especially on, uh, on interchange. on just in case all right there we go good good run started with a pistol and a backpack Got a lot of gear out of it <laughs> yeah we'll go reserve you need to get down low Go. I don't have to go down here actually besides to kill scavs because we already touched the crate. Don't have to do it again. Boss down here. Four player. Oh. Right versus left hand peak is rough, dude. It is rough. Three bullets of blunt damage. Is this us? No. It is right versus left hand peak. Right hand peaks have, have a major advantage on left hand peaks in Tarkov. I wish they'd do like a full shoulder swap mechanic, but most shooters. Actually not. Most shooters, it's um the vision is central instead of like heavy right eyed. We'll rock this guy. We're going to leave the bag because I don't, I don't really need a bag. I'll loot up a little bit because we do need the blue tapes and xenomorph. But I can put the xenomorph here if we absolutely need, if we do find one. Went right there and right there. We only need two more. Um, and then we can grab a backpack off a of scav. So like, that'll be fine. Oh, same spawn. I need to get to the underground. But this time... Played a little safe. Safe fur. <laughs> Someone running downstairs. Ain't that through the flash to listen for Gluhar? Um, this is the gun build. Two of them down there. stuck in between a rock and a hard place I could go up there and like disengage and hide I really want to do that oh fuck
I don't know my back plate tanked that entire shot. That makes zero sense. Right? Like, I got hit in the front. How did my back plate take damage? And I didn't take any damage. Yeah, I got shot from the sniper over here. Whenever I was up top. I don't like this position I'm in though. Could have been a suppressed shot from behind. At the exact same time someone shot at me from in front. No clue. Could just be Tarkov things. I think this is AI. Yeah, his movements AI. Or it's the players who have baiting me, but no. to make it hard to peek that angle now, because Omi is going to be paying attention to this spot. That click server side too? Nah, I don't think so. But you have to be semi close to hear the the click. Scav locks on. Holy shit, man. I'm going to reposition into the train here. I'm worried like as soon as I go to serve that scabs can push in. The upgrade slash build and hide out for hearts. Hardcore. Um... I mean, the workbench, I want to get the weapon uh, rack. Lav upgraded. You go, through, you go to like the mid uh, hideout upgrades. This is not too many like late game ones that are massively important. It depends on if you're wanting to go to Kappa as well. If you're, if you're wanting to push for Kappa, yeah, there's... You know, like weapons, uh, or, uh, I mean, the weapons rack at one, two, and three, honestly, but, uh, the workbench. No, I don't want to go over there. I think that guy's still sniping back there. Better safe than sorry. I'm also kind of slow playing it because we need to get into the, uh, nice to take that blue fuel. We need to get into RBST and the SMP and KSM keys. RBST we could get from doing a different quest, so it's not that big of a deal.
<laughs> we went to the wrong building. I don't think they couldn't hear where I was shooting from. I don't think they had ears. But that guy kind of gave away his position there and it's not going to be safe for me to push. He doesn't have a bolty though. Honestly, I could push that. I could. I could. And that one scav hat. I could have kept the cash. Well, where the fuck is this man's? I think he'd be tower. Never find him. Yeah, apparently not. Not bad. All right, let's go check our BST. Please be open. No. Next spot would be the uh, KSM and SMP keys. Big Knights building. Yeah, I could hit the um, filing cabinets, but. Not that concerned with it. Pretty late to going downstairs. I'm sure the if there were any of the uh, raiders up, they're done. They're done for. They're dead. Damn. Does not look like the key. Yeah. Doesn't look like those have been hit. All right. Last thing to look for will be the barracks buildings being open for us. Movement over there just now. What do you consider the most balanced caliber right now? Probably 5.56. Five, A lot of people hate on 5.56 uh, five, five, though. 5.56 five, five, and 7.6251 I find to be my favorite calibers. What ammo we got in that? Yes, ammo. How much? 10 rounds. 11 rounds. What do we have in this? PP ammo. Almost empty. How's it going, Chuck? We're trying to get in some of the uh, key to rooms that we have to request. We're being gate kept by keys. I also just need a survival on reserve. And then we're also looking for... I don't upgrade items. I'm almost at my weapons rack. We're not too far off.
Let's see what modes and ammo this guy has. None. I have to get upstairs. And then check these rooms. This might have been one of the locked ones, actually. And maybe not. But if so, that's looking good for us. It is a locked room. There we go. Okay, that's actually pretty big because it means the other ones are likely unlocked. I know one of them's unlocked already. Yeah. If they're going to unlock one, usually go through and unlock all of them. This is the one that's... This one upstairs. I mean, we could try and push the other building. Not a whole lot of time left. Almost might be better to push under and then up. Just gonna check this for... Our Xenomorph or blue tape. We'll take that one. Oh, actually, no, we didn't. That one. There was a barter for the FCON for something, but it's not. I don't think it's anything we need. I, it was the gray fuel, which we don't. We don't need that. Because I already have a grenades case. The gray fuel empty ends up uh, crafting into grenade boxes. We already have that. The blue one empty ends up crafting into magazine cases, which we do need. Okay, need it for the third one. I, I had went in that one. It's okay. We got one of the locked rooms, which I'm, I'm okay with. I'm happy with. Now we need to kill scavs in that building. Yeah, we gotta do reserve.